Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we're talking about iCloud and more specifically, I'm going to show you how to change the payment method that you use with your iCloud account. So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off, if you're not familiar with iCloud, basically all it is is Apple's version of the cloud storage. So it's similar to Google Drive, Dropbox, and you can store all of your documents and photos and files in there. And they have a free plan, which is only five gigabytes. But if you need more space than that, then they do charge. And on this video, I'm gonna show you how to change the payment that you have associated with your iCloud. So it's all gonna happen here on the iPhone settings app. It's this gray app right here. It looks like a gear icon. I'm gonna go ahead and open it now. All right, once you click there, you're gonna get this drop down menu, but be sure to stick around to the end of the video, guys. It's really quick, not a lot of steps involved with this. But in order to access your iCloud, you're gonna click on your name here at the top. You're gonna to have your profile icon right here. It might be your picture or just some general icon like what I have. It doesn't really matter. Just click on the top here underneath settings. I'm going to click there now. Okay, guys, I went ahead and clicked there and then it's going to bring up information about your Apple ID. Now, you probably know if you click here on iCloud, there's nowhere in there to change your payment method because the thing is iCloud is built right through your Apple ID, just like your iTunes or your Apple Music. All of those things are built through your Apple ID payment method. And how you're gonna change that is gonna be right here on payments and shipping. I'm gonna click there now. All right, I went ahead and click there. Next, the payments and shipping tab pops up and it's gonna show all the payment methods that you have associated with your Apple ID. Now, the thing is you can't have a separate payment for your iCloud and a separate payment for your Apple Music. All of it bills basically to the same payment method. But what you can do is you can go ahead and delete the payment method that you're currently using if you'd like. And all you do is just click on the payment method arrow that's next to it. So if you have more than one payment method, they're all gonna be listed here. I just have the one, but if you wanna go ahead and delete that, you just click on this arrow. I'm gonna click there now. Okay, once you click there, it's gonna bring up the card information. You can easily just click that remove button right there. I'm not gonna do that just because this is my primary card that I use for my iCloud. And if you wanna change the payment method, go ahead and click back here. Okay, next here we are here on the payment screen. So you can go ahead and add a different credit card or debit card as a payment method. I'm gonna click here now. So here on this screen, you can go ahead and change the iCloud payment method to either Apple Cash, Apple Card, credit or debit card if you wanna add that, and even PayPal. Depending on which one you wanna choose, you can wanna click on there and then it'll walk you through the steps on how to add each individual payment method for your iCloud. But keep in mind by changing the payment method for your Apple ID, it's going to change the payment method for your iCloud, but also gonna change the payment method for all of the other items that bill through your Apple ID. So there you have it. That is how you can update the payment method for your iCloud. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. But hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel. And I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.